our crew with Swissport Fueling Services at Chicago Midway International Airport is without a doubt one of the best in the country. And uh, we couldn't do that without quality individuals. And one of those is a gentleman by the name of Pierre Brown. I've been fueling for about 20 years now. I enjoy it. We had a phrase in the Army. When you're employed with aviation, you do more before nine o'clock than a lot of people do all day. I get here about four o'clock every morning, and you have people leaving out at five o'clock, so you got to be there and be prepared to do your job. So it's, it's enjoyable, but it's, it's kind of hectic too. In the summertime, you bake all summer. You freeze all winter, and you get wet all spring. When it's sub-zero, it'll break you. A couple of times I wanted to cry, you know, I was aching so bad. But if you can deal with that and dress accordingly, you're cool. When you start off fueling the plane, you look at the nose number, make sure the nose number matches your ticket. You open up your panels and see what you need, you pre-check and all that. You put your cone down by the pit. The pit is where the fuel comes from. Put your moose head down from your hydrant. You run your ground cable. It equalizes the charge. Then you hook up. The single point is the hose you reel out to hook up to the plane. You write your meter numbers down. I use the meter on the car to see how many gallons that's going on the plane. And you can check to see how fast you're pumping. You pull your dead man and you should start fueling. The dead man name came from, you could drop it and it, the hydrogen should cut off immediately. It's real easy to goof up because you holler, I got time. It don't leave out for, for 40 minutes. And then you may run into a problem with the hydrogen. The hydrogen card is what the fuel come through. And now you catching a delay. So that's on you for goofing off. As long as I've been here, I've never called it a delay. In the 18 years, I've never called it a delay. And I take pride in what I do. You get what you want to get, you do it in reverse. Put everything back proper, and you good to go. Always glance back and make sure everything in order. See, some people will run away from it and forget they didn't left the panel door open. And then you got to come back, and that makes you look bad. That makes you look real bad. When we bring the tickets upstairs, they say thank you, which makes me feel good. But some of the pilots say, hey, we can't go nowhere without the fuel. And they say thanks. It lifts your spirits up. I would tell the people that's flying out, you got enough fuel to make it to your destination. You definitely got enough fuel. If you take pride in what you do, you won't have so many problems in life.